What's up YouTube, Steampunk Yu-Gi-Oh here coming at you with uh, my very first Yu-Gi-Oh Pro tag dueling video. It is with Jack Asian, he is not here with me right now. Uh, he wanted to originally upload the video, but his camera thing was acting up so he couldn't. And Yu-Gi-Oh Pro for him was acting up so he couldn't. So this tag duel, me and Jack Asian played, I was playing my Go 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 Zombies deck and he was playing his Skull Servant Piper deck. Uh, I will give respective links to the deck profiles in the link below. Um, so let's start. What's up YouTube? Steampunk Yu-Gi-Oh here again. Commentating on the tag duel I had with Jack Asian. As I said before, I'm playing Go 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 Zombies. Jack Asian is playing Skull Servant Piper. And our opponents are playing both Hazy Beast and Light Sworn respectively. So I hope you guys enjoy this and let's get this underway. So I drew into my Pyramid Turtle. Uh, I play Duality. I probably should have gotten Creature Swap. No, wait, I get Creature Swap later. Some of my Card Trooper I mill off. Um, Zombie Master, Maxi, and Gores, so it's their turn. Look at that hand. Oh, man. Huh. So he had JD from the start. So he attacks over my Trooper, and I draw into MST, which doesn't really help me at this point. But I'm glad they didn't play any back row. See Jack Asian's hand. He has two very good power cards in his hand, but you know he doesn't really want to do anything. He's gonna wait to drop the trag. Uh, our hazy beast guy sack for the griff grips whatever, and he set like mad back row. So it's my turn. I really don't know what to do, so I just MST a random card and set that and set my pyramid turtle and turn. So it's his turn now. The ice form player he sets the bottomless. Jane attacks into Pyramid Turtle, and I grab Zombie Master. And then his grips is too weak, so he can't really do anything with it. Jane mills off Lugla and Gragoneth. Jack Asian's turn again. Let's see. Again with the power cards. I don't know why he didn't MST something, but you know, whatever. Um. Yeah, I basically told him to do that play with the Pyramid Turtle. He'll, he'll even tell you that. <laughs> Uh, we exhausted all their advantage, but this isn't really like a duel where we like guaranteed one. We had to fight for it, as you guys soon see. Um, now they're not looking too good themselves, but you know, they do a lot of shenanigans here, and me and Jack Asian get really behind. So he attacks with that guy. And that guy destroys the Skull Servant for whatever reason. I'm not really sure why. He destroyed the Skull Servant with that thing, whatever it was. Gragoneth, me like Fire Dog and stuff. I drew into another duality, and I was kind of thinking whether or not I should pot of Avarice. Jack Asian's complaining about how I took his Weisel and put it in my extra deck, or in my deck. And I duality, and there's the Weisel, Go 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 Ghost, and Zombie Master. And I choose to get Ghost. So I set Ghost, and I set. Uh, compulse. Now that guy's hand isn't looking too good, so I wait till he does. It. Well, I don't compulse anything yet. Um, I veiler the Gragonet so he won't pierce me for mad damage. I'm so sad I didn't get to summon the Grand Soil, but you know it happens. So Jack Agent's turn again. He drew into Gores, so he's gonna pro hole and set MST and just pass turn. That's the Fire King Yaksha. I don't know why it, it, its picture isn't showing up. Probably because Yu Gi Oh! Pro doesn't have it yet. Um, but yeah, that's the Fire King Yaksha. I think. Yeah, it says Yaksha. So I draw into Book of Life. I use Book of Life to get back Zombie Master. And I use Trag's Effect to steal the Yaksha, so nothing. Nothing sinister happens. I get back go 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 ghost. Uh, attack for some quaint damage. Uh, I believe I'm going to go into Shockmaster this turn and call spells. When in reality I should have called monster effects. <laughs> but you know, you know how that works. Yep, go Shockmaster, call spells. But as you can see, no spells in hand. A bottomless, Lumina, and JD. Uh, now, 
he set his bottomless, and I don't know why he set it and then used JD's effect. Uh, I, I really don't know. Like, I, I severely don't know. <laughs> Someone's going in attacks, and we get hit for some mad damage, four grand. Then he mills a bunch, and then he gets two wolves off of it, off of the JD mill. And I think off of the Lumina mill too, I don't think he, no. He doesn't mill anything good. He got two JDs off the JD mill, which is surprising. So Jack Asian draws the Foolish, decides to Foolish his Skull Servant because he doesn't want to top deck it. It's our opponent's turn. So, he does something smart. He goes Evolve All Chain and stacks his deck so that Sphinx is guaranteed to go off. And then he does a bunch of dirty things. Yeah, Basil caught. Ugh. Like, could you imagine being in our situation? I was kind of ready to scoop it up, but Jack Asian's like, no, don't give up. We'll win. Or, you know, he really didn't think we would win at this point, but. I actually misplay here. I go Evolve All Chain, and I forget to use his effect on to Mill Mizuki because I just crashed into the Evolve All Chain over there, and so I was kind of stupid for doing that. Yeah, I admit to misplaying, so what? And I set my heavy storm and I just pass turn. And he top decks a Raikou. Uh, oddly enough, he uses the Raikou to blow up the heavy storm. Jack Asian top decks a King of the Skull Servant, I believe. And they hit another wolf. And he t yeah, top decks King and attacks over wolf. Now, it's funny, our opponent did not Raiko the right thing here. He chose to Raiko the back row instead of the King of Skull Servants. And I don't know why he's not banishing our Skull Servant with the Basilcock. They misplay a lot with the Basilcock. Like, they banish different things and things that aren't on the field where else they could have game and he set the Praetan thing and I draw and I'm like oh man so I set my go 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 golem not knowing what that face down monster is um I was thinking hopefully he'd recharge into something but he used Basilcock to banish the white mare and then of course go 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 golem can't be destroyed and Jack Asian, top deck's a one for one. Now we're really going for luck this time to go off Piper. I didn't think, he doesn't have a Catastrophe in his extra deck. So he drew the White Mare and then King of Skull Servant. So he used White Mare's effect to recycle the other White Mare and make it his King 3000 so it can crash over Basilcock. And I told him he should have switched to Go 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 Golem to attack mode, but he didn't. I don't know why. Um, so he draws a Horn of the Phantom Beasts. So he pretty much can't do anything. So I draw, I draw Gores, pretty useless at this point, but I switch my Golem to attack mode and attack over the Prairie Ton and attack with King Skull Servants for three grand. And it's our opponent's turn. He has recharge and he top decks a Light Sworn. And he really doesn't recharge into, into anything. He recharges into Saber and the Field Spell, so he ends and Jack Asian's like, draw, and then it's like, attack for game. And three grand. All right, that was our ta our epic tag duel. Um, links to the deck builds will or the deck profiles will be in the description below if you want them. Subscribe to me or Jack Asian. And as always, thanks for watching YouTube.